If this video is useful to you, please like, share, subscribe, click bell icon and select all to get all my new video notifications. So hi friends, in today's class, I am going to explain about divisibility rule for 7. You never find this divisibility rule anywhere. You know 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 11, but nobody knows exact divisibility rule of 7. In this video, I am going to explain about divisibility rule of 7. Must watch this video till the end. Don't skip this video. Please friends, watch the video till the end. This is very important technique. You never find anywhere this technique. So compulsory at the end of the video, I will give you some new, new important questions that will covered in all the competitive exams at the same time, all school exams. Must watch this video till the end. Now we'll move into this divisibility rule of seven. Before going to that, we should know that G digit sum technique already we have a video so digit sum technique see here 1 2 3 4 digit sum technique is nothing but 1 plus 2 is 3 3 plus 3 is 6 6 plus 4 is 10 this is called digit sum technique this technique we used here divisibility rule of 7 Already we have a video, you can check out that in playlist or in i button. So see here, suppose 7 1s are 7 means we have 7, 7 2s are 14, 7 3s are 21 and 7 4s are 28. Check here, 7 means you can write here 0 7. 0 plus 7 is that is 7, 1 plus 4 is 5, 2 plus 1 is 3 and here 2 plus 8 is 10. Again you can write this is into 1. Now if you observe here 7 minus 5 is 2 or 5 minus 7 is minus 2, 3 minus 5 is minus 2 or 5 minus 3 is plus 2. This is very important here. Now we will apply this rule. Check here. Look at one example. 49. Okay. 49 is divisible by 7 or not. We will check here. So 49. Simply you multiply with minus 2. That is called this minus 2 is called digit sum variation digit sum variation so minus 2 simply 9 into 2 that is minus 18 so here write, directly write down here 4 so 4 minus 18 how much you will get that is minus 14 by simply minus 7 7 to the 14 so that this 49 can be divisible by 7 Look at one more example that is 63. Simply multiply with minus 2. Minus 2 into 3 that is minus 6. Simply you write down 6 as it is. 6 minus 6 is 0. 0 by 7 that is equal to 0. So that this 63 is divisible by 7. Look at one more example that is a 340. 343 is divisible by 7 or not. Simply you multiply with the minus 2. Minus 2 into 3 only unit place number. Unit place digit should be multiplied. That is minus 2 into 3 is minus 6. As it is write down this 34. So 34 minus 6 is 28. By 7 this is 4. That means this can be easily divisible by 7. Look at one more example here that is 2401. 
only we required here only unit place digit that is into minus 2 this is minus 2 write down as it is 240 240 minus 2 is 238 238 by 7 that is 7 3 is a 21 7 4 is a 28 so that this can be easily divisible by 9 look at one more example here uh, we will uh, check uh, 77 ok 77 into minus 2 this is 7 2 is a minus 14 here here 7 so how much you will get 7 minus 14 that is minus 7 by minus 7 that equal to 1 so that this 77 can be divisible by 7 very simple you never find this technique whether the given number is divisible by 7 or not now look at one more example that is 91 91 into minus 2 simply only unit place digit multiply that is minus 2 write down this 9 as it is 9 minus 2 is 7 7 by 7 that is, this is divisible by 7 that is 1 so that this 91 can be easily divisible look at 92 92 into minus 2 minus 2 into 2 that is minus 4 write down here 9 so 9 minus 4 is 5 5 by 7 this cannot be divisible by 7 this total number also cannot be divisible by 7 this is very important technique you never find this anywhere look at one more example that is 144 144 is divisible by 7 or not simply minus 2 you write down minus 2 into 4 is minus 8 write down here 14 14 minus 8 is 6 6 by 7 this cannot be divisible by 7 so that this number cannot be divisible by 7 so this is the divisibility rule of 7 so did some technique here variation variation is 2 variation is 2 here only unit place digit should be multiplied here so look at here some different types of examples 3 bull 1 3 bull 2 3 bull 3 and 3 bull 4 like this 3 bull 6 these numbers can be divisible by 3 these numbers always divisible by 3 here 3 bull 1 3 bull 2 3 bull 3 3 bull 4 3 bull 6 and 3 bull 7 and so on these always divisible by 7 this is very important trick trick friends you never find this trick anywhere always you will get this type of question in all the exams like rrb and ibps combination of questions you will get this like here check the example suppose they will ask 99 by 3 plus 3 bull 1 divided by 3 into 7 like this they will ask here we can use directly this trick so friends divisibility rule of 7 the basic thing is variation variation is 2 so i hope this video is very much useful to you if this video is useful to you please share and subscribe and like my video and click the bell icon select all okay friends thank you